Mahindra Defense Systems of India has begun delivering Mahindra Armado, an armored light specialist vehicle designed specifically for the Indian military. The new vehicle was designed and manufactured locally. In addition to accommodating a driver and five passengers, the Armado has an increased carrying capacity of 400 kilograms, bringing the total carrying capacity to 1,400 kilograms. It can be utilized in anti-terrorist operations, assaults in open and desert terrain, and reconnaissance missions. It can be used by special forces and rapid reaction teams for conventional operations, weapon transport, border patrolling, etc. The vehicle is said to be resistant to armor-piercing projectiles of varying calibers. It has level B7 protection. B7 level protection is a specific level of ballistic protection for vehicles, typically used to characterize resistance against bullets and other ballistic threats such as grenades and landmines. The B7 classification is a portion of the internationally recognized ballistic protection standard, known as the EN 1063 standard, which provides a classification system for bullet-resistant glass and other transparent armor materials. Armor-piercing bullets, such as 7.62 by 51 mm NATO or 7.62 by 54 mm rimmed, are often unable to pierce the protection of B7-level armed vehicles. You can watch a video in which I compare various types of bullets by clicking the link in the video's description. Additionally, the vehicle possesses STANAG Level 2 Ballistic Protection. STANAG is an acronym that stands for NATO Standardization Agreement. It refers to a set of standards that member nations of NATO have come to an agreement on in order to assure interoperability and compatibility in a variety of military domains, including defense equipment and vehicles. STANAG Level 2 provides protection against multiple types of small arms ammunition, such as 9x19mm parabellum and rifle bullets, such as 7.62 and 5.56 rounds. In most cases, the construction of the vehicle's armor will require the employment of ballistic steel or composite materials. However, the effectiveness of STANAG Level 2 protection can be affected by a variety of factors, including the specific design and materials used in the armor, as well as the angle and range at which the incoming rounds are coming from. STANAG Level 2 provides adequate protection against small weapons fire, although this protection may not be as good as that provided by higher STANAG levels or more specialized armor constructions. When it comes to protecting against .50 caliber armor-piercing rounds, neither B7 nor STANAG Level 2 is good enough.